Hello, my name is Madison. Welcome to my channel, if you haven't been here before. Today, I'm going to open this Beauty Beast Reloaded 24-Day Advent Calendar. I'm pretty excited. I've heard some really good reviews about this. It is on Amazon currently for $9.95 plus tax and shipping. Um, there is the original Beauty Beast, but I um, liked the products in this one. Uh, the reviews I heard a little better. So, if I really like this one, I might go back and get the other one. But I have this one I'm doing today, opening all 24 boxes, and we're going to see what we think. And I also have a fidget one coming in the mail, which I'll open all 24 boxes in a video, too. I typically will do a, a vlog this where I film every day and have certain advent calendars I open every day. So, like, I have a sock one, a love one, uh... A, a tea one this year so those are for my videos but I specifically this year wanted to do some where I pick out certain ones from uh, the internet and just order them and do 24 videos so let's get started with day one which looks like it's right here in the middle and it looks like it's really quite skinny almost it's very tiny so let's uh let's see what could be in here Pull the door back a little. Um, okay, so it must have gotten pushed down. Um, so let's move on to day two, and we'll find that in a little bit. Uh, day two is up here. And here we go. Let's see what we get. Okay, so it looks like we're getting something two-faced, it says. So it's two faced. It's a, a little, I think it's a lipstick. Let's see. Oh, yeah, it's a lipstick. This is like the tiniest little lipstick. This color is like super red. So that's like cute, but like it's kind of really tiny in my opinion. Very tiny. Okay, let's find day three. Day three is non existent. Where'd you go, Dave? Uh, am I just blind? Where is it? Day 14. I wonder if this is day 3. Oh, here it is. Right here, this little box. Alright, ooh, this is kind of cute. Let's see what we get. So this is like the tiniest, and I mean the tiniest bronzer I have ever seen. This is so cute, though. It's like the tiniest little bronzer. Very cute, but very tiny. Sorry it took me forever to find day three. So I'm going to push back the doors we found. So we found day two and three. Day four is... Fourteen six. Oh, here's day four. It's a very skinny one, so I'm gonna guess it might be like a brow pencil, maybe, or like a lip liner. We'll see. We'll see if I can get it out. I feel like the constructions of advent boxes need to get better over the years. And they, they just, they don't, in my opinion. And it like, it, it's like stuck in here. <laughs> here we go. Oh, there we go. Oh, okay. Well, it certainly is hard to get to. Here, here we go. I got it. I got it. Yay! And uh, I think there was a cap on this, and it came off. So this is a lip pencil. It's a lip crayon. And it comes in this, like, very, like, bubble gummy, bubble gummy pink bubble gum pink if I can speak correctly today that'd be great okay day five is up here and I think it's probably gonna be another like lipstick maybe by the shape of it oh no it's not a lipstick it is the tiniest little illuminator what is this this is a I don't know exactly what this is. Maybe some kind of cream? It's like some kind of cream or something. It says pearl. Which is 
like a little pink thing. This is literally 0.17 fluid ounces. Like, pinky size. Tidy. Cute, but tidy. Okay, the next thing we get, day six is down here. And I think day six is, oh, that's interesting. Okay, so day six is actually a set of tweezers. Those are actually really nice. So these, these are a set of pink tweezers. Very cool. And they even come with this like little cover. That's actually really, these are really good quality in my opinion. They seem like they are. Um, I'm no like makeup guru, but I have had to do makeup for guard and just like certain things in general. Um, but yeah, I like the quality of those. Okay, that's day six, so let's find day seven, and I think this is another lip liner, perhaps? Oh yeah, it's another lip liner. Definitely is another lip liner by the shape. Ooh, here we go, here we go. Okay, so this is another lip pencil, rather, not liner. Ooh, and this is like a burgundy color. Like, look at that color. Very much like burgundy color. So we got that. Okay, and then let's move to day eight. Which is over here, and I'm gonna guess it's like another pencil or a lip liner maybe. It looks like it's another... A lip liner, perhaps. Which, I'm not mad at. Lip liners are good. Like, I like lip pencils. They're, uh... I don't know. There's something good to carry in your purse. If I can get it. Oh, come on, little friend. There we go. Oh, my God. If I can get it out. So, this is a King Cole. Definitely a very blackest black. Like, the blackest black. And I'm going to guess this is supposed to be an eyeliner pencil type thing. And that is very black. Okay. So, day seven. Let's go to day eight, which is... Somewhere around here. Day eight. Where you at? It's so hard to find. Like, they're literally the tiniest numbers. Okay. So, I can't find eight, but I found nine. And I'm going to guess it's another lipstick, maybe? Perhaps? It's very tiny, so... Oh, no, it's another one of these, like, cream things. They're called Illuminators, and this one's a copper bronze. So I'm guessing these are, like, maybe foundations, concealer-type things. I don't really know. They're kind of tiny and hard to tell. Okay, so that was day nine. Let's find day... Day ten's right up here. By the shape, I'm going to guess it's another lipstick. Nope, it is not. It is another one of those tiny little, I think they're foundations. There's some kind of cream-based makeup that I have just, like, never seen or heard of. And they're by W7, and they're the Illuminator brand. So I like it so far. Those, uh, cute ones. Okay. Day 11 is... Right here. And I'm going to guess this is like some kind of powder. Oh, well, uh, I guess it's uh, currently missing, so we'll have to find that in a minute. Right, let's go to day 12, which is over here in the corner. And it's also missing its product. So let's go to day 13. Which is another round circle. Let's see. Will it have its item in it? Will I be able to open it? Gosh. 
this like I feel like I need like some kind of like there we go this does have a good side of it let's uh let's pull it out oh my gosh it's like stuck <laughs> straight up stuck in the packaging Okay, but this is like, I think it's another like foundation type thing. Ow! Like I'm straight, I can't get it out. Come on, there we go. And this is a very pretty pink shine. Oh, that's actually really pretty. It's like a shine type thing. Okay. Day 14 is right here. And it looks like it's a mascara, perhaps? Perhaps a mascara? Yes, it is a very tiny, little, absolute lash mascara. It's a travel size. How cute. A lot of these products are very tiny, which I expect in an advent calendar. Okay, I think we're on day, yep, 15. And it's up here. And I swear if we get another one of those squeeze tubes, like give me something different, man. Okay, so I got a two Fabulous, and this is like an actual color I'd wear. Like, it's a very nudie color. Okay. Now for day 16 over here, and this is a huge box. So I'm assuming it'll be a big product. Let's see. Let's see what we get. I mean... Kind of assuming, like, maybe a sheet mask at this point. Like, I haven't got... Oh, okay. Yeah, I don't have much hope. <laughs> it's a, a very cute scrunchie. Like, the tidiest little scrunchie. Okay. Day 17 is right here. And it's a bigger circle, so... I don't know. And not in where it's supposed to be. Cool. Cool, cool. Okay, let's find 18. 18's over here, and it looks like it's a brow pencil. And a lot of the stuff is just, like, falling out. So here's the brow pencil. And this is a bright red. Like, bright, bright red. So that's 18. 19 is up here. And it's an interesting shaped box, so let's see what we're getting here. Oh, a little cute hair bow. I don't, I don't know what I feel about that. It's cute, I guess. Okay, day 19. All right, let's find day 20. Here's day 20. And day 20 is actually a pretty good quality watermelon wave with hydration. This is a glow moisturizer. That's actually not a bad quality one. Okay. And I'm going to kind of just pull everything else I'm seeing out from here so you can kind of see everything and everything doesn't just keep like going in different directions. So let me do that and I will show you the different items that we still have yet to see. So I think that is everything from the box. So. We get this candy blush, and it is the tiniest, cutest little thing I've ever seen in my life. Very cute. Very tiny. Um, very hard to open. There we go. It's actually not a bad color. I might use it. Might not. We'll see. We got another shimmer. Um, yeah, another little shimmer. We got a Banana Dreams powder concealer very tiny to get that um two more lipsticks one is a red orangey color oops <laughs> and one is a bright red i found the lids to um the pencils so that's great that's great always like lids items and the glosses we get are literally the teeniest little glosses like 
this will last me maybe a month, if that. Like, this is teeny tiny. Um, but, you know, they're not bad colors. I, I don't hate it. This one has some really, you know, sparkly colors in it. So you get these three glosses. So, um, do I think some of the products have good quality? Yes. Yes, I do. I think this is a pretty good, good quality, um, item. And, you know, this probably is a travel size and it probably would run for roughly, I think they sell them for like $7, this kind. This mascara probably would sell for 10 So, you know, and it's travel size. And I think these items, you are getting your money's worth with these two. I mean, yeah, scrunchies do sell for a decent amount of money nowadays, like $3 at least. Little hair bow, same thing. This is um, not crap quality, but it's not something that I'd wear on a daily basis. I do wear scrunchies, so that'll be a good thing. I do think this blush is pretty good, and typically these type of blushes uh, sell for like $4. Um, these like little travel size lipstick, I think it's cool because you get four, um, and I think it's a good variety of colors for everybody. Um, these typically sell for probably, I think, like $2. So I don't think that's bad, but would I have liked to see um, a little bit bigger of a size of a lipstick? Maybe. Maybe that would have been great. I really like these shimmers. I think these are great different color varieties too for different skins. I think these are cute. I do like that they give you a powder option. Um, and then just the uh, pad for concealers. I like that. I don't know um, exactly what these are. I really, really don't. Um, but they're cute. And I'm going to try and figure out. I think they are different concealers. Um, so yeah, I like those. I am very happy that they give you lip liners and in different colors, different shades. So like if you have a darker lip you like or a lighter lip, it gives you different options and variety. And I like that they give you a brow pencil that's just straight black. Because I think black really, um, for eyeliner, in my opinion, it works for everybody. Like you can use this. And my favorite touch, I really do like these. I really do. These are really great. I like these. That is all I have for today. Um, yeah. Bye, guys.